So what is the molar mass of calcium phosphide? Well, let's use this table to help organize our thoughts. Bam, so the first thing is I'm gonna write down the particular element or the elements that I see. So I have calcium in calcium phosphide and phosphorus. Next is then to identify the number of atoms. This is where the subscripts come into play. So the subscript of calcium here is a three. That means we have three calcium atoms and then we have two phosphorus. Cool. This also, by the way, could represent the number of moles as well. All right, but it doesn't really matter. Atoms are, you know, atoms are moles, tomato, tomato. If you're calculating molar mass, technically this would be number of moles, but all the math here will work out the same, all right? So what we're going to do is uh, we're going to take those numbers that we just found and multiply by the mass of each particular element that's found in the periodic table, all right? So let's take a look. So the mass of calcium here is about 40.08, and the mass of phosphorus is about 30.97. The magnitudes of those numbers are identical no matter if you're calculating molar mass or molecular mass. If it's molar mass, the units are just in terms of grams per mole, and molecular mass then will be in terms of AMU. All right, so let's write that down. So here for calcium, we got 40.08, and here we have 30.97 for phosphorus. Then all we're simply gonna do is, was it 0.97? Yeah, 0.97, cool, just had to double check. Then the total mass of the element, now uh, we're going to simply multiply this row on a cross. All right, so 40.08 times three is gonna work out to be about 120.24, I think. And then here, 30.97 times two should work out to be about 61.94. And then to find the total mass now of the entire compound, literally just add this column together. Add up all the totals of each particular element. And that should work out to be now 182.18. And since we're solving for molar mass, uh, this is going to be in terms of grams per mole. And that's all there is to it. Thanks for tuning in. I do hope this helps. If it did, give us a hand, like, subscribe, tell your friends. All right, we'll see you soon. Take care.